What's going on YouTube? It's been quite a while since you've seen this mug on the screen, but it's E3 time. Things are changing personally. My son has turned one years old. I'm trying to get a better balance between content and fatherhood. That whole thing's been crazy. Um, I'm gonna have a bunch of reactions for a lot of stuff that came out in the past couple days. Now I'm gonna be honest and upfront. I've seen all these trailers before. The first reactions I recorded while I was watching their live streams for whatever reason, on my OBS, the sound and the video were just so off, they're unsalvageable. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna rewatch them, just kinda give my thoughts on them, my opinions on them, see where they're at, and then uh, see what you guys think. And honestly, I'm just very excited because E3 season is coming. I have registered and I am a member of the E3 Press Media. So I will have some exclusive looks at some gameplay reveals that I'll have on this channel. So make sure you like, and subscribe i mean you don't have to subscribe but you know that'd be great uh as you see in the text uh that way yeah i don't know how perspective works it's going to be virtual fighter 5 big virtual fighter fan i love the game i'm not a veteran i'm not experienced i remember my first time with virtual fighter was we had a family friend who was really into the arcade scene when i was younger and he would take me to all like the hotspot arcades, not the little local amusement ones. I'm talking the big boy arcades where people were playing for money and the fighting game scene was real rowdy. He would take me and I remember going to this uh, arcade and they had just got Virtual Fighter 2 and it must have been like 50, 60 people there and people were playing for money, had the big screen. And I just remember the visuals were so mind blowing and I tried playing it, but I was just bad. And every Virtual Fighter I've played since, I'm pretty bad. I love fighting games with Virtual Fighter. I've never been able to crack. So I will be going in on Virtual Fighter 5. I think it's cool that Sega brought it back. And even though it's never been my favorite fighting game, I feel like it's important. So I think its presence in the fighting game scene is necessary. And I'm excited for all the new people and people like myself who've only dabbled to dig deeper. But I'm really excited for people that have been going in, like uh, Arturo uh, Sanchez, NYC Furby. Him and his group of friends, they are big into Virtual Fighter, and Virtual Fighter obviously is still big in Japan. So let's check this out, let's see how it looks. Um, and uh, let's do it. I actually haven't seen this trailer, I saw like the gameplay overview. Classic. HD. Go time, baby. Oh wow, yeah. It's a cool trailer. Still yeah. animations, man. Ready? So sick. The original OG grappler for me. Oh, my man. I love the monk. Yeah, how can you be mad at that? Coming out June 1st. Now, they did put out, and I know this has been like a thing that people are talking about. Um, they are not having rollback netcode which you know obviously it would be fantastic if they had rollback netcode but it's a game that's 15 years old or, or older actually and it's going to be free on playstation plus so you know I, i'm not like going to be mad about it what i hope for is that this game re-establishes virtual fighter enough to where they can fully budget a brand new Virtual Fighter 6, and that is where I would hope that like rollback netcode and all that stuff is implemented. But I'm not going to let something like that ruin my enjoyment of a game that they didn't have to bring back, especially Sega the way they work. So I'm pretty pumped about it. And uh, yeah, I think this trailer was really cool. I think I saw the longer gameplay overview, so this was actually new to me. Um, yeah, but I can't wait to play it. Uh, I'll be playing on Twitch, uh, same name as my YouTube. And uh, I'll be playing Guilty Gear. Also, I'll be having that for review. So I'll have that up pre-release. Uh, so if you guys want to come over there and check that out as well. 
And hopefully people come and school me because I'm bad at this game. So come uh, throw hands. I'm willing to catch them. All right. Have a good one, everybody.